Breaking news, hush puppy. We have reasonable grounds to prosecute against Abba Kiari. Finally, AGF Malami speaks on Abba Kiari. Hello, my wonderful people. As this consigns the United States, Nigerian government cannot hide for so long. Abba Kiari has been suspended by Nigerian uh, police force. However, on the grounds of the U.S. requesting that he be extradited for questioning on the accusation that has been levied against him in regards to fraudulent activities carried out by one Raymond Abase, uh, popularly called Hush Puppy, you know, Nigerian government has not done justice on that grounds. The case in the U.S. has been postponed till uh, the case has been postponed for further hearing. See, for the notice, nothing has been done in that light, in that regard. Mm -hmm. um, and right now we're hearing from Melami that they have grounds. Uh, Nigerian government all of a sudden has investigated because, you know, the U.S. is like a patient dog. And what did they say concerning the patient dog? He eats the fattest bone. He's patient. He's going to get it. He's really going to get it. Let's get the details. What is happening now? We have reasonable grounds to prosecute against Abba Kiari. Malami finally speaks. Police authority conducted an inquiry into Mr. Abba Kiari's role in scam, but continue to keep sealed lips over the outcome, despite persistent demand for public disclosure by Nigerians. The Attorney General of the Federation, Abubakar Malami, has said there were reasonable grounds to prosecute against the suspected celebrated cop officer Abba Kiari, who was fingered in a multi-million dollar fraud spearheaded by Raymond Abase, aka Hush Puppy. Malami disclosed this while appearing on China's television politics today on Monday. The U.S. government had, in July 2021, unveiled the charges against Mr. Kiari, an other alleged conspirator to the scam. Hush Puppy, a Nigerian internet celebrity, until his arrest in Dubai, UAE, in June 2020, is one of the arrowhead of the scam. He had pleaded guilty to the charges. He has pleaded guilty to the charges, and he sentenced is billed to come up later the, this year. Police authority conducted an inquiry into Abakari's rule in the scam, but continue to keep sealed lips over the outcome, despite persistent demand from the public to know what the outcome has been. Confirmation, Mr. Malami, whose office was Fought with the report of the police investigation, confirm on Monday that there were reasonable grounds to proceed against Mr. Kiari by either putting him on extradition, extraditing him to the U.S. Yet charges are pending against him. As far as I'm concerned, the parties are discussing, the parties are collaborating, and there are exchange of correspondence from the perspectives of investigations, from the perspective of the extradition and associated things, he said. Asked if Mr. Carey was found guilty by the police report, Mr. Malami said, you cannot find someone guilty, but perhaps reasonable ground for prosecution can be established, which will translate into prosecution that will eventually translate to whether guilty or not. He added, this is why we are talking of reasonable grounds for reasonable grounds for speculations which have established that we will eventually translate to the possibility of prosecution and eventual conviction if the end of the day one is at one of the cases is found to be adjournable in court. The position now is that there are firm grounds, reasonable grounds for speculations. There has been conspiration from the perspective of prosecutors of likely extradition if the need for so being across, that is what is unfolding in the terms of international collaboration. Mr. Malami also said there were also an ongoing collaboration with the U.S. authority over Hush Puppy. So that is the Attorney General of the Federation who has been hiding and covering for um, uh, 
Abakiari. Abakiari in Nigeria is one of those cups that has been, if you say celebrated, yes. If you say appreciated, given awards, yes. Not knowing below the belt, there were some, you know, there were some little, little things, okay, that keep, that keep, you know, they say the little, little foxes, they spoil the vine. Little, little foxes here and there, but they spoil the whole vine. You know, when someone has an habit or something that, you know, no matter if you don't deal with a particular character that you keep being warned about, guess what? You will climb up the ladder, get the honors and everything. And that very singular habit could just be what will pull the man all the way down. And, you know, if, you, if you've been following um, a, a gospel sensation, a musician in Nigeria, we all heard of what happened to him recently. You know, he's a gospel singer. He sings and all of a sudden, I mean, there've been rumors of things about him regarding that area. He's married, wife and kids, went to the U.S., and they um, had a play, a play away match. You know what I'm talking about. And just that little thing, you know, that has not been thoroughly dealt with. You know, this man has had invitations to some of the biggest um, religious centers in Nigeria. Talk about real big religious homes and houses in the country. He's been there, well celebrated. He has a th theme of young men and women, you know, singing with him, you know. And all of a sudden, that little thing you don't deal with. Perhaps yours is anger. Maybe you just like to talk too much. People have disclosed something very important to you, but you can't just keep your mouth shut. You must tell somebody. I just want to tell you. It's just you I'm telling. So long as it has left your mouth, it's no longer a secret. Who told you that that person you are telling does not have another person he will tell and say, I'm just telling you. That's it. And before you know it, you are being called upon and roped into, but I told you not to tell anyone. And at the end of the day, trust is destroyed. Relationship is broken just because you could not keep your mouth shut. And you feel like, look, you know, like a rat that has been dropped inside a rain of water. Perhaps yours is just eating too much. You go somewhere, they give you something. You cannot just eat a little and stop. You can't just say, thank you. Must you eat everything? You know, there are just little, little things here and there. That if we don't pay attention to them, these things come around. And you see, the what you do to it, how you handle it, go a very long way. It will speak, you know, character is one thing we must mold. Your charisma, your giftings may take you very far. But if the character is not developed, it stinks. It makes a beautiful, just like a very beautiful girl. She opens her mouth and the mouth is like a gutter. How do you feel? Mm. That's it. That's when character is not developed. Leave us a comment. Bye for now.